here at Frankston we are trying to live out the mission of the Salvation Army and we believe that the Salvation Army makes the most sense in disadvantaged communities and we're in Frankston North which is a very disadvantaged um, neighbourhood in Victoria. The Ministry of the Frankston Corps is in a bit of a transition phase at the moment and what we're really looking to do is partner with our local community and uh, schools and uh, the local city council and the local youth workers to really make a lasting impact in our local community. I think a lot of core really have closed their, closed their doors to the local community, um, not because they've wanted to, I guess there might have been a little bit of fear around you know, being accepted and what does it mean for our style of worship and so forth. Um, but really in order to, to bring faith, hope and love to the world, which is really our mandate here at Frankston, and that's going to take trial and error. So we might start something and it may not work, it might flop, but that's okay. Um, so then we'll try something else and just kind of, I guess, see what's a good fit. It is frightening to try new things, especially if you've been doing the same thing for a long time. That might require change and change is hard. So we're doing a few different things at the moment including different programs in the, both the primary school and the high school. Uh, I think living in the community that you're trying to reach is a good idea because you're not driving in somewhere and trying to do ministry and then driving home again. You're actually a part of the neighbourhood and you're going to the, your kids are going to the same schools, you're shopping in the same place, you're going to the same parks. For me, that is the most effective way to really get to know people and, and share Jesus with people. I think a lot of Christians can be perceived as us and them. And when you come into a neighbourhood and just become one of the people and just hang out with people and spend time with people rather than coming into you know, this is my project and I want to save you. Um, yeah, I guess it's just a more natural way to share the gospel.